Tennis. So we've seen two great games in the SWIL, but yeah. maybe the game of the night was over <laughs> at BHS because if you want more proof that the SWIL is crazy this year, it is. here you go. Independence marches down to Griffith Field, overcomes a huge deficit, and takes the drillers to the limit. This game will be decided in the game's final seconds. A thriller in Central Bakersfield this one. But the drillers strike first. It appeared they might cruise in this game. Asani Rufus right here puts it up for Kevin Hayes, who leaps and makes the grab for the touchdown. Drillers on top, seven to nothing. Okay, here come the drillers now in the second quarter. Marcus Bruce breaks off a long touchdown run. It's 14 nothing, BHS. Just another ho hum day at the office for the drillers. Again, Independence punting here, but the punt, a line drive, and here's a great play. It's picked up by Shaq Garrett. He is not known for returning punts, uh, but the now. big fella picks it up, <laughs> and you're not going to stop him. That's a touchdown, and it's 21 nothing. BHS. Maybe they took their foot off the accelerator after that big lead because Independence coming back. Preston Hodges looking for DJ Reed, who had a big night as a receiver, makes the catch there for the touchdown. That made it 21 to seven. Independence now looking for more as Hodges going deep, looking for Derek Check. Pierce to take this one in for the touchdown, but it was actually a called out of bounds. So the touchdown did not stand, but still a big game for Independence, and they would not go away as the drive continues now. Khalil Illy for the touchdown, make it 21-14. BHS looking for an answer. They get it right here. Asani Rufus, the quarterback, really carried this team in the second half, and he does it right here with a big gain. So they're deep in Falcon territory. And then Rufus calls his own number again, this time for the touchdown. And that gave a 28-14 lead to BHS. It's 28-21 now. Here's the play of the game. It's a huge play as Hodges escapes the pressure, huh. fires it deep. And this pass to the sideline is tipped and caught by DJ Reed, who then takes off, gets a couple blocks, and he's gone for the touchdown. That would tie the score at 28 apiece wow. with about two minutes left to go. But we mentioned how Rufus took over in the second half. He does it again on the drillers' ensuing possession. This play was just huge. As he carries the ball deep into Falcon territory, and with a minute to go, they bring on Parker Campbell for what would be a game-winning field goal, and he's not going to miss. Such a great kicker, and that was the difference. As BHS somehow survives the scare from Independence, the drillers go on to win it. 31 to 28. And what a great weapon Parker Campbell is out oh, there. Always. You get into field goal range and the game's pretty safe. We've been safe. talking BHS for the state, and why not? Before the Liberty game. Now they just got to win the Southwest. You see everything. This turned out to be a hairy league. All right.